Good morning everyone and welcome to the CFA. My name is Mike Forshew, I'm the Executive Manager of ICT Services, um, responsible for leading the team that uh, brought us here today. Thank you very much for coming out on such a wonderful day. This is a, a very large project for CFA, 42 odd million dollars, um, and the number of people who are here today and the number of organisations who are being represented here today I think says a couple of things. It says this is a broad-based project that relies on a number of people coming together in a partnership and we value that partnership. A robust and reliable communication system is critical for firefighter safety. And again, with firefighter safety in mind, that will allow us to enable an automatic vehicle location technology. So this is more than simply a dispatch communication service. Uh, it will provide a lifeblood of communications for our firefighters. It will enhance community safety and allow us to move to uh, the next generation of safety um, technology for our firefighters. Again, I want to reinforce that a strategic direction that CFA has adopted over the last three or four years has been one that we are shaping the organisation to support the safety of our communities and to focus our resources at supporting our frontline firefighters and community educators. Thank you, Ewan. Uh, as Ewan mentioned, that this is a, a partnership between CFA and a number of other organisations. Critical to this has been the involvement from other members of uh, not only the emergency services, being uh, ESTA, uh, but also our uh, partners in this particular project being, being Telstra. With that in mind, I'd like to welcome Chris Pearce from Telstra, who's the Executive Director of Government and Not-for-Profit Sales. Telstra is proud of the strong working relationship we have with the Government of Victoria and key agencies, including the CFA. Through our work with the CFA, as well as ongoing efforts with programs such as Emergency Alert, Telstra is providing the infrastructure to help keep regional Victoria a safe place. This partnership with the CFA is designed to give fire brigades faster information on a more reliable platform through the Telstra network. Since 2009, the CFA have been negotiating on behalf of the emergency services in Victoria. The aim was to deliver a world-class radio communication system for the exclusive use of Victorian public safety organisations. Today, a milestone has been reached with the announcement of the execution of the contracts. Telstra has been chosen as the successful tenderer. Under the new contract, Telstra will build and maintain infrastructure for CFA digital radio services in regional Victoria. The Hume, Grampians, Loddon Mallee CFA operational districts will be the first to receive the new service and technology. The new service is due to be implemented by June 2014. I've put a circle around June 2014, ensuring every regional brigade is able to access clear and reliable radio communications no matter where they are. The dispatch service will allow brigades to speak directly with emergency call centre operators from the fire ground, reducing the risk of communication failures and improving safety for both the CFA members and the community. It will improve communications between agencies such as police, ambulance and ensure a consistent approach for the dispatch of CFA and SES units. Improving CFA communications was a key recommendation of the Victorian Bushfires Royal Commission. The upgrade from the analogue to digital radio service is an important step in delivering on this recommendation.